A furniture dealer orders a dozen armchairs listed at $38 each, less trade discounts of 25%, 15%, and 10%. We'd like to determine the net price of the entire order. Well, first of all, we know that there are a dozen armchairs, so we're going to make a note of that. And we also know that the list price, L, is $38 each. So we'll make a note of that. And we, furthermore, we have trade discounts of 25%. So discount 1 is 25%. Discount 2 is 15%. And discount 3 is 10%. Let's carry on. From our trade discount relationship, we know that the net price, N, is equal to the list price minus the discounts. So we have 1 minus D1, 1 minus D2, and 1 minus D3. So we're going to substitute our list price of $38, and we're going to multiply that by 1 minus 25%, 1 minus 15%, and 1 minus 10 percent. Calculating, we have 1 less 25 percent. That leaves us with 0.75 or 75 percent. 1 minus 15 percent is 0 0.85 or 85 percent. And 1 less 10 percent is 0 0.90 or 90 percent. Let's begin by calculating multiplying the three factors first, 0.75 times 0.85 times 0.90. And we're going to end up with, on our calculator, $38 times uh, a factor of um, 0 0.57375. Please note that this actually represents the net cost factor of our um, three trade discounts. So we've got a net cost factor of 57.375%. So our net price is going to end up being 57.375% of our list. Now multiplying this net cost factor of 0.57375 by the list price of $38, we end up with a net price for each of our chairs of $21.80. Now, we have um, purchased one dozen of these chairs, so one dozen chairs will cost 12 times $21.80, or in other words, our total net cost will be $261.60 for the dozen chairs.